Okay, so today we're going to do a little launch activity as we're trying to figure out what density is. It's called the neutral buoyancy or the hovering egg. The instructions are mounted for you there, so if you lose track or need some help, please refer to that. All right, so what we've got here is there is a container full of uh, some salt water, water with salt mixed in it, and you've got an egg, a raw egg, so be careful. You break your egg, well, then you're done. So your job is to try to get the density of the water to be exactly the same as the density of the egg. And we can increase the density of the water by adding salt. We can decrease the density of the water, make it less uh, heavy, less dense, by adding water. So you'll start off by taking your raw egg and very carefully placing it in your solution to see what happens. Now if the egg sinks, sunk egg. We have to get the egg out. I would use the spoon and you can reach in and get it because it's just salt water. Put the egg back in this little super special egg holder so it doesn't roll off or get damaged and then you will add salt. So what you have to do is pour in some salt. You just kind of have to guess. Now as you dissolve the salt into the water there's now more stuff in the same amount of space. The salt molecules fit in between the gaps between the water molecules. So as you stir it, you have to stop it from spinning so you counter stir it or stir it the opposite way and then just kind of move it around until the water isn't spinning anymore. Then you would take and place your egg in again and see what happens. If it still sinks, well then you have to add more salt. Now, that's the technique for making the water denser. Now, once you add enough salt, if your solution now becomes so dense, there's so much stuff packed in there that when you put the egg in, that the egg actually floats, well then it's denser than the egg, so it pushes the egg up. So, what you need to do in that situation is you have to then add some water. Add fresh water to it. That will decrease the density and then put your egg back in and we see oh it's a little less dense now so we're on the right path when you get really close you can actually then leave the egg in while you very carefully pour in fresh water to decrease the density and you can eventually get the egg to start sinking so you do that until you think you've got it just at the right density. Now what are you trying to get? Well, what we're trying to get is over here, there'll be two black marks on your bottle, and you want to get it so that your egg, when we look at it from the side, is in between the two black marks. That means you've achieved neutral buoyancy or neutral density. So when you think you got it there, just let it sit and go sit down because we have to let the solution clear, uh, clear up a little bit. We'll then work on our notes a little bit, talk about what density is, give you some info, and then we'll see in about no, 10, 15 minutes part way through the notes how it looks and you can come back and make your final adjustments before I evaluate it. When you're done then, what we have to do is we have to prepare the solution so it's not neutrally uh, dense anymore, the neutral buoyancy, so you'll pour about half of it out and then fill it back up with fresh water so it's not dense enough. So the next group will have to go through the same process and try by adding salt and then taking salt away, try to achieve neutral buoyancy. All right, go back and get started.